City Matters in downtown Texarkana will soon have another addition, a vintage rail car. However, it's currently stuck on Highway 67 due to the storms. NBC6's Dominic Dillon shares one man's vision, though, to revitalize the area. A vintage rail car headed to downtown Texarkana hits a road bump. Storms have halted its journey. It'll spend the night on Highway 67. This rail car, once used to travel from Los Angeles to Chicago. We're going to set it up and shine it up and make it look really nice, get a restaurant here to run a restaurant out of it and make it a really a tourist stop. It's taken months to figure out how to properly move the train due to it weighing nearly 100,000 pounds. The train car's owner, David Peavy, says it's part of what used to be known as the train of the stars. Ben Crosby and Elizabeth Taylor and those type of people would ride on the train going back east. This rail car is going to be placed right behind me on the corner of Front and Olive Street. And we're going to make it something that, that Texacana will be proud of. And when they relatives come in, they'll have something proud that they can show people. This restaurant to be named the Flying Crow. We are thinking a coffee shop in the morning and it might blend into more dinner uh, casual food. TV hopes this downtown attraction will give people a taste of Texarkana's rich history. We're going to have a train depot that we're going to create on the outside, which will look like you're getting up on the train, getting up, ready to tr travel on the train. We have Texarkana on the end like you're at the Texarkana station. Soon to be downtown destination, maybe ready for business as early as October. Dominique Dillon, NBC6 News.